Hey there, thank you so much for coming back to join me for this week's Dollar Tree Gold. So somebody did request to see these, and so I thought, why not? I did buy them, and I've been trying them out. So I'm talking about the um, Arm & Hammer Essentials Kids 3-in-1. So it's shampoo, conditioner, and body wash. And I have two different um, scents. I have Underwater Melon Kiwi and Sea Monster Mango. So if you'd like to see these in action, um, my thoughts on them, if I'd recommend them, all that kind of stuff, then... Please keep on watching. All right, so yeah, I bought these at Dollar Tree at my last Dollar Tree shopping trip, and I really, really like the um, Arm & Hammer Essentials body washes. They're great, absolutely love them. They smell amazing and everything like that. So when I saw the kids three in one, I'm like, okay, I'll pick them up and try them, especially since they're kind of like summer fragrances. But um, this is SLE, SLES free, uh, vegan, paraben free, dye free, not tested on animals, no tears, all that kind of stuff. So I've been really, really loving the watermelon one. I've been using it a lot. And then I really actually do like the Sea Monster Mango as well. They both smell absolutely amazing, incredible, very fruity, very summery, everything like that. But let me go ahead and show you the kiwi, the kiwi watermelon one in action, um, and then we'll go in and discuss it. There's things that I like about it, and there's things that I don't like about it, so here you go. So I've used a lot of sulfate-free products and some of them are very low sensing. This is one of those, uh, very, very low sensing. I have used this in my hair. In the video, I just used it as body wash, but I have used this in my hair and I feel like I have to use a lot of product to get any kind of sensing action. Um, so that is the one thing I don't like about these um, is that it's very, very low sensing and I feel like you have to use a lot. I've maybe used this maybe five times and you can kind of see how much is gone. And it's a little bit watery, it's not too bad. Um, I definitely think the positives outweigh the negatives. Yeah, the scent is stellar, absolutely stellar. I've been pairing this with my Watermelon um, Mojito Body Spray from Bath & Body Works. Perfect watermelon pairing. Um, anyway, so something, some things that I do like about this is I do like that they're vegan, cruelty-free, dye-free, you know, all those free, I really, really like that. I think that this is really, really good for sensitive skin, whether it's for a kid or for an adult. I think it being free of those so many, so many things that is gonna be really good for people that have like really sensitive skin, sensitivities to those certain ingredients. Um, I love that, like I've said in multiple videos, that more affordable brands are going the vegan cruelty-free route. I think that's great opening up options for everybody. There's a lot of people that do um, decide to go with the vegan or cruelty-free route, so I do think there's gonna be more affordable products out there for those individuals. Maybe if you're someone that is looking into going that route, there's gonna be options for you out there at the Dollar Tree, which is awesome. Um, but I absolutely love these. Besides the low sudsing, um, I, I, you know, I can definitely get down with these. I would definitely repurchase these as well. That's how much I do like them. I wish that they'd come out with adult versions. I mean, of course, just because it says kids on it doesn't mean that anybody can't use it. I bought these for me to try. Um, so, I, once again, just because it says it's made for kids doesn't mean that not anybody, you know, everybody could use this. So I really, really like these. I think they're a good product. You do get 12 fluid ounces, which I do think is quite a bit. Um, and Arm & Hammer is a really, really good brand. Their antiperspirants are really good. Their toothpaste are really good. And like I said, just the normal um, Arm & Hammer Essentials body washes are spectacular. They do have those at Dollar Tree as well, but really, really good stuff. So if you are looking for something that is vegan, cruelty-free, um, you know, dye free, all that kind of stuff. I would definitely recommend these. 
Um, the scents are really, really nice. They linger a tiny bit on the skin. Like when you get out, you can smell a little bit of something on the skin. It's not like you're using Caress or Dial or um, Irish Spring. It's not gonna be that much scent left over on the skin, but there is a little bit of something, which I think is lovely. So yeah, I think this is a good product. I definitely think, you know, when I've used it in my hair, I definitely think it does, has some conditioning aspects to it. It does leave the skin very soft and the hair as well. So this is a great three in one, whether for yourself or for kids, grandkids, whatever really, really good stuff. So I do like these. I definitely think they're a Dollar Tree Gold. If you are someone that is sensitive to a lot of those ingredients, if you're looking for something maybe a little bit more natural, maybe something that's vegan or cruelty free, I would definitely give these a go. They both are amazing. I definitely think I do prefer the watermelon kiwi a little more than the mango, but they're both really, really good products. So I do like these and I would recommend them, even with the downside of them being very low sudsing but it's still getting you clean, your body and your hair. I think a lot of us are just so used to like heavy sudsing products that we don't feel like stuff is getting clean unless we have that heavy sudsing and that's not the case. Um, I kind of need to get out of that mindset of if it's not sudsing very much, I'm not getting clean and that's not the case. Um, so definitely recommend these, definitely a Dollar Tree Gold and like I said, the scent is spectacular. It smells like a watermelon Jolly Rancher. So love these so, so much. Definitely worth the $1.25. And like I said, I would definitely repurchase them. That's how much I do enjoy them. So anyway, there we go. Short and, sh short and sweet this week. Um, I hope you did enjoy today's video. If you did, go ahead and give the video a thumbs up, share it, all that jazz. Let me know down below in the comments um, if you picked these up, if you've tried them at your local Dollar Tree, what did you think of them? Love to know down below. And if you haven't subscribed yet, make sure you do that. I do upload seven days a week, all about budget beauty. Um, it's not just the outside, it's what's on the inside, your home, your wallet, all sorts of stuff. So make sure that you do subscribe, but I appreciate you stopping by. Another video should start auto playing here in a moment. It might be one of mine, it might be somebody else's, but to sit back, relax, enjoy. I'll see you here in just a second.